Hey everybody, it's Elaine the Ninja Life Coach and welcome to my channel today. Today we're going to talk about gray wigs. So sit back, grab yourselves a cup of coffee. I'll be right back. Hey everybody, I'm back. And as most of you probably know, I made a video about this, but in case you didn't see it, um, my hair has been thinning out even more than usual. So I'm just kind of waiting for autumn to fully kick in here in the South before I decide what to do about wigs. Now, one thing that I am probably going to do is to get my hair cut pretty short. I've, I've just had it cut and I'm not real happy with the way it was cut. Uh, my regular hairdresser wasn't there and I let the lady who was there cut my hair because my regular hairdresser was on vacation. So I wish I hadn't done that because I'm not real happy with it, but um, I had to tell myself just how much can she actually do with the amount of hair that I have left. So what I decided to do was to um, try out some gray wigs because I am not gonna be coloring my hair, I don't think, um, for a little bit. And I'm gonna see if that doesn't help some of the fallout. Now, I have seen some new growth with my hair, so I'm thinking it might be coming back, but I don't know. My doctor has suggested that I get on perhaps uh, minoxidil or something like that, that that might help, but he thinks that it's due to COVID and due to stress, which I wouldn't doubt that one little bit. <laughs> so I want your all's opinion on which one of these wigs you think looks the best. So this one is Beckett with Hair Kitty Kitty. And I do have Beckett pulled back and I have a little bump right here to give me some height. Hold on, Trixie's wanting down. Hop down, baby girl, hop down. I'm actually making this video today in my bedroom because I do have it set up now in my bedroom where I can film in here at my makeup station. And I am really thrilled to be able to do that. I finally figured out what to do with this ring light and how to get everything set up in here. Praise the Lord. But what do you all think about this one? I'm on the fence about this wig. I really like it. I think the part looks really good. The lace front is really pretty. I'm just not sure about me and this style because when I take it down and I have Beckett just kind of loose, I think Beckett is a little overpowering for my face. I, I really think that it is. Um, I don't like to say that because I really like the wig, but I think as long as I pull it back and do something, I think I would be okay with this wig. Now, let's move on to the next one, which is Ellen Villa Eclat. And I want to get your opinion on that, and you all let me know what you think. It's very similar to this, but the gray is a different color. So, be right back. This is Ellen Villa Eclat in Salt and Pepper Mix. Now let me turn around, let me let you see this wig. I like the length of this wig. I think this is pretty. I like the curl pattern of this wig. I think that kind of saves the wig from making it look frumpy, is that particular, is that particular thing. This wig is lace front. It has a mono top and it is hand tied and it has a breathable, one of those breathable caps. Um, not, it's a closed cap, but it's very, very lightweight. This wig does have a lot of hair, but honestly, this wig weighs almost nothing. So this wig is going to be a little cooler. So I think this might be a better option for summer. This color is dis distinctly different than the one that I just had on by Hair Kitty Kitty. And I think I said the wrong color. That color is Smoke Show. So here's this wig. Now, I do like this wig. Of the three, this one is probably my favorite as far as the wig itself and as far as the feel of the wig on my head. This wig feels good. This wig is not excessively hot and it fits my head well. Ellen Villa fits my head better than any wig ever. It fits me better than Hair Kitty Kitty or any other wig that I've ever represented, but um, I am just not sure about this style and I'm not sure about the color. It is the salt, it is salt and pepper mix. This wig, I don't think this color is available here in the United States. I got this wig from Chiquelle in Canada, 
when I did a, a program for them. They sent me this wig as a free wig and I just really love it. I just wanted a, I wanted a gray wig at the time and I love this. I think this wig is really, really pretty. Um, but you tell me what you all think. Now let's move on to the next one, which is Ellen Villa Spring High in Snow Mix. I, I kind of hate to put this one on my head because I know what I'm gonna hear from the wig community. Be right back. Okay, so this is Ellen Villa Spring High in Snow Mix. Now, I know most everybody from the comments that I get on this wig, I know most everybody really likes this wig on me. I do not like this wig on me anymore. I used to back when I had shorter gray hair, but now I think it just makes me look sad and like a granny. And I am in fact a granny, but I don't know that I want to look like one. I think if I put a head wrap on this wig, I think that would improve it and make me feel a little bit more um, youthful when I wore this wig. In fact, let me try that. Be right back. Okay, so here it is with a head wrap. I do think that improves the look of the wig somewhat. I do think also that this wig would be fairly cool because it's short, but I don't know that a head wrap is gonna make it that much cooler because head wraps do kind of tend to make wigs a little bit warm. So I don't know, I'm on the fence here and I am taking a poll. <laughs> Which one of these wigs do you think looks the best? I think that if I style them a little bit, I can probably wear all three of them, but I really want your opinion on this because I know there are a lot of folks out there that know a lot more about wigs than I do, and I just would like to hear your opinion, unless your opinion is this one looks the best, and then I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I really do want to hear your opinion. Um, I do think on some level I look better with short hair, but on another level, I do think that maybe I just need another style besides this one. Because when I think about this wig, I, I didn't used to feel this way about this wig, but I do now after I've seen myself back with red hair. It's almost like I'm like, oh no, 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 no. I can't, I can't go back to that. I just can't. But, you know, I'm trying. I've worn this wig for another video that I made, and I'm trying to embrace this a little bit more. So, guys, hope y'all have a wonderful day. Everything I do is down in the description box. God bless you all. Maranatha, folks. I love you guys. Bye-bye.